taking a look at a lovely platter of oysters because it is National Oyster Day. And so to celebrate, we're hanging out at Station 16 in downtown Sacramento, which, by the way, is the only place downtown with an oyster bar. Take a look how beautiful this is. Brantley renovated. Brantley, rather. Brantley. I'm making a word up. Newly renovated here. Taylor, how are you? I'm well. How are you? Good. Thank you. So Taylor is the man behind the bar who answers all the questions, all the burning questions people have about oysters. Now, I personally love this aphrodisiac. Um, it tastes good. It just really, truly t takes, tastes fantastic when you have the right dipping sauce. And even if it's just a squeeze of a lemon, it is fantastic. It is. All right. So let's go ahead and talk about the different species you have displayed on your bar right now. So on any given day, we generally have four different species of oysters. These are small Pacifics from Hood Canal. These are blue points from New York. Kumamotos, which are farm raised in Humboldt Bay and Washington. And then Shigokus, which are also farm raised in Washington around the Puget Sound. Wow, so fantastic. Do me a favor, hold that up for me. Now, Tina and Cammy, take a look at that. They get oysters delivered fresh by truck every single morning. And it's so cool. I it, like it looks, I smell it. it I just want to like dive right in. Yeah, they're delicious. They're, they are delicious. Now, also, too, here's the thing about oysters. You want to learn how to shuck. They actually have a big shucking festival and competition happening at the end of the month, which we'll talk about. But will you please teach me? Because I have no idea what I'm doing. Sure. All right. All right, so here we have, uh, I have an oyster for you. All right. And this is your shucker. Okay. And then shucking is just the act of opening the shell. Okay. And detaching the meat from from it. Okay, so where exactly am I, uh, right here? So we're going to go in here on the hinge. Okay. These I did not practice this ahead of time. Yeah, let's, yeah, sh no. let's show. <laughs> so we're going right. to come in under the hinge, and we're just going to pry it up. The camera? Uh-huh. Oh. It's going to come in under the hinge Ooh. and pry it up. And then we're going to twist to separate the top from the bottom. So here's, here's the question. How many oysters could a shig, 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 just kidding. I totally made that up. You're like, what is happening right Probably 200 on 200. Day. Really? You, you shuck 200 oysters a day? Sometimes more. Wow, that's so impressive. Okay, actually, I, I'll, I will try that. Let me take yours. Yeah, yeah. And then I have to try it at the very end. Ah, oh, bye. Yeah, of so course. So talk me through that. Take that. And then yep. I got to go. All right, here we go. So we just come in on the hinge. Flip that upside down for me. Oh, this, oh, this is. Oh, that. Just come in on the hinge. Okay. Right in between there. Try to pry it apart. Use oh, the ah, leverage. That was terrible. Just kind of push it in under that white if you can. It's not, it's not easy for that is really. That is actually really good. I probably should have tried that before going on air. All right, so Tina and Campy, I'm going to toss it back to you by trying an oyster here. Also, too, they do pairings, which is why you see the rosé out and displayed like that. All right, so Taylor, which, am I gonna, which one am I going to try before tossing back to the anchors? Um, let's try a small Pacific from Hood Canal. All right, take that one. No problem. All right. Do you like you oysters? Lemon. I love oysters. Oh, my God. Mmm. Good stuff. That is good. That is good. Okay, guys, back over to you. Happy National Oyster Day. Appreciate like it. Oysters. Thanks, Taylor. It's an aphrodisiac. Mm. Oh, she's